talking about how girls judge guys so I feel like you know every girl judges a guy differently all girls judge but I feel like there are some ways that are kind of like signs that a girl will be like well he did this so I'm not really sure how I feel about him I'm not really sure what that means so today I'm talking about a few anything. little things that you can kind of think of that a girl's gonna judge you by the first one girls judge a guy based on how they tip you know, you guys are out to a dinner and you know, you're like, oh, I don't have that much cash on me, whatever, I just leave her $2 and it's like a $40 check. That looks so bad. Like, I would honestly, if I went out with a guy and he was a bad tipper, and I'm not saying you have to be, you know, like Mr. Stacks on Stacks and shit, but just, you know, a, you know, a good tipper, I would really honestly probably not see them again. Because the truth is, you know, these waitresses work hard, you know, you don't make that much money. I've been a waitress, so I know how it is, and I know that's why I tip well. And I feel like the way a guy treats um, you know, people who are waiting on him is a really, really, really big deal. So again, you don't have to blow all your money and, you know, give like a 75% tip, but leave a good, generous tip. Uh, of course, maybe unless the waitress was really, really bad and dropped food all over you and cursed you out or some shit. Next is how you treat your mother or how you treat your aunt or how you treat any, just the women in general of your, like your family and stuff like that. Because if you're the kind of guy who is mean to your mom and like this is kind of disrespectful and just listen to her, that's, it, you know, there's this, thing, there's this saying that the way he, he treats his mother is the way he's gonna treat you if you guys get married. So be nice to your moms, guys. They birthed you or your aunts or, you know, your godmothers or even your teachers and stuff like that. Be nice to older ladies. Just do it. Cause it's cute when you're nice to older ladies and it's cute when you're nice to your mom and we're gonna be like, swoon. The next thing we, we judge you on is your hygiene. And we, you know, I'm sure most girls don't care that you're not wearing, you know, designer clothes or you don't, you know, aren't wearing whatever freaking Hollister cologne. I don't know. But, you know, if you go out of your way to make sure that you look, you know, you tried to look nice, you maybe got a haircut, you made sure that your face was clean, you know, you don't have like smudges of dirt on you and, you know, you're eating in a restaurant and you're not like using your hands like a barbarian, just like basic hygiene, that goes a long way. And if you're not, girls are going to be like, we're our, like on, you know, we're just starting out and he already doesn't care how he looks. Imagine if we date for a year, he's going to be like just walking on his underwear and not shower for days. Ew. So just basic hygiene. A girl's gonna judge you by how you talk about your ex. If you're one of those people who's really bitter and you have really big, like deep rooted, unresolved issues with an ex girlfriend or something, I would suggest not even bringing her up because you're gonna be on a date and also you're gonna be like listen to what this bitch did listen to what this dumb bitch did like no we would rather not so just don't even bring that shit up if we see that you're bitter or that you're talking shit about her and that you're like saying all this crazy stuff personal stuff we're gonna be like damn what if i date this person and we break up and then he goes around saying all this shit about me so don't be a weirdo, crazy, psycho asshole about your ex. Because we're going to judge you based on how you react to talking about them. So yeah, these are just a few ways that girls judge guys, kind of like in the beginning of a relationship, maybe even a first date. You know, pay attention to these. Make sure you're generous and nice and you listen to her and you're not a psycho. And hopefully things will go good. I hope you guys just I'll talk to you later. Bye! Katana wins. Fatality. Take you away.